Yeah, good evening, everyone. My name is Bright Chinedu Agbawo. I'm going to take you on setting out that is in basic tech. And first of all, we're going to discuss or define what is setting out. Setting out, this is the process of transferring with high degree of skills and accuracy the detail of the foundation plan from the building plan onto the ground with pegs, line, and tips. It's just all about making sure that whatever that is in the plan, in the building plan, is accurately measured and the ground so that mistakes or building collapse will not occur. And for accuracy setting, setting out, the following materials are needed. The steel square, the pegs, the tape, the building plan, the profile board, the building lines, the nail, the lines, hammer, and plumb. With these, there are functions. Each and every one of them have their own functions. The steel square, this is used to set out the angle of small buildings. Then the building square, it is used to with the same way, but in this case, it has a measurement of 150 meter, uh, millimeter times 38 millimeter. That is to say, it has a double measurement from it. Then the pegs are just piece of wood. These are such. This is used in setting out the square end of the building, and also there are areas to be excavated by driven them into the ground. So these are just to mark. It's basically to map out measurements. Then the tapes is used for measurement. It is used for measuring the building dimensions as stated in the building plans. Then with this, you can see some of the some of the materials. We have the building lines here. We have the plumb. We have the building plan, the steel square, the pegs, and the profile lines. And in continuation, we said the building plan. You see, this is the prepared this is the prepared drawing for the building. All information concerning the building is taken from the drawing in the plan. Hope we are getting what I'm saying because without the building plan, there will not be a building. Because you have to plan before you actualize what's the plan. Uh, the profile board. This is a piece of timber nailed to the peg to carry lines. And these lines are just walls. That is walls that are mapped out in the building plans. Then the building lines. These are referred to as frontage line. That is the walls. This basically represents the walls. Then the nails, we will do what nails are used for. They are normally used to heat or join two things together. But these are driven into top of the profile board and also used for nailing profile board to the pegs so that those that are digging the foundation can see the lines clearly. And these are lines. This, the definition of the lines is this are run from nails of the profile board. As you can see in this drawing, you will see lines. You will see lines being sketched. These are basically initially used. We use lines to map out these foundational buildings. And the hammer, normally we use hammer to drive pegs into the ground. And also drive nails into the board and uh, profile board. Then the plumb is used for checking the square yeah. and the levelness of the edge. You can see a picture of it at the third slide. They have different sizes and their functions. Now, setting out exercise. You say after the set, the site has been leveled and the material used for the building operation provided. The frontage line is taken accordingly to the local authority by law of the establishment of building lines. Then, after establishing the building lines, the square 
end of the building line are set out using either the following either you use the steel square or the building square these are basically used for mapping out where the building will be then see you use tapes pegs that makes use of the ratio three ratio four ratio five based on the pythagoras theorem and also a wooden peg or stake is driven into the ground at the corner of the building all these processes are just steps or exercises you need to undergo or you need to follow to make sure you get a pro proper location where the building will be mapped out because any mistake you make from the foundation is going to affect the structure and also we know the importance of foundation that when the foundation is tampered with the building is at stake a nail is driven into the center of the top of the each peg and straight lines stretch between the pegs now this is mapping out the walls each walls locate the position of the third peg using the ratio 3 ratio 4 ratio 5 ensuring that angles at the corner is at right angle and this is definitely you know that for a building or for a room to be squared it must be at a right angle the location of the peg at the other corner of the building is made with reference to the first square end in conclusion i will say profile boards are then nailed to the pegs to ensure accurate setting out of the walls and foundation footings the square the four square ends form the outline of the building and these are plumbed down before excavation could begin another word for excavation can be digging the foundation digging the foundation so after before you dig the foundation you must map out using these exercises or these processes or these steps to map it out so here are some assignments you need to do number one is define the following setting out building lines now, number two is list and explain the uses of five tools used for setting out. Thank you.